The traders are counting their losses after the Makola shopping mall fire outbreak, destroying items like jewelry, perfumes, cosmetics and wigs. Over the years, the traders have raised concerns about the facility's management, leading to the anticipated disaster. Six of us, again, their things are burned this year again. Their, their, their things are burned last two years, and this year again, they are among again. Where did they want to start? I lost a lot of money. More than, more than 400,000 Ghana cities. Let me say, you see, you're crabbing 40 years ago. They are only concerned about the revenue they generate from us and not our welfare. Paying rent ranging from 4,000 cities to 8,000 cities yearly, traders expected more from MMC Property Management Limited, who are managing the facility on behalf of SNIT. The whole place is choked. The staircase has been given as a, a, a shop. Uh, uh, there is no place to pass. When you are passing, somebody's appetite is there. There is no ventilation. You can even see it. All these containers. The Ghana Union of Traders Association's leadership, while sympathizing with its members, criticized SNIT for creating a ghetto-like and poorly structured market for traders. For SNIT to put up such a structure is unfortunate. Uh, we don't know what informed them to put up such a structure. And then I, I was even surprised that uh, the fire service were able to come here to even put the fire off. The whole place is not well structured. Guta leadership and MMC Property Management Limited executives engage in a heated argument over a potential compensation package for traders. Acting Managing Director of the company, John Apia, has been credited with supervising certain infractions at the facility. This has developed over time and uh, with hindsight that conclusion could be made. It was purely to take care of their safety needs which led to this situation. Currently, there are no immediate plans for compensation for these traders but rather a decongestion of the facility. If management is doing their work properly, I think we will not get to here. Two years ago, there was a similar fire disaster at this very spot. If our recommendations were made, I'm tempted to believe that they were not implemented. The fight against market fires appear to be a Herculean tax. Hopefully, this is the last of its kind. George Quinnin, TV3 News, Makola. Yeah.